Hello everyone, my name is Peace Cute and welcome to my channel. I'm very happy to have you all here. Today is a great day because Masters of Air just released and we have two episodes. I hope I can manage to react to both of them today. And I'm very, 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 very excited because I already watched Band of Brothers and I watched The Pacific and I feel like, you know, I'm prepared, I'm ready. My knowledge is, is there, it's not the most advanced knowledge, but I don't go literally blind, blind sided so if you like this reaction if you would like me to continue with it don't forget to like and subscribe i'm really really grateful as well if you want to see the full length reaction there is a patreon the link is in the description below now the episodes are being released from my understanding every friday but that's kind of like very late for me it's like 2 3 a.m or something like that so it's not gonna happen so what's gonna happen it's me reacting to them on a saturday edits and then on sunday we're gonna have the episodes on youtube like this is in a perfect world plan scenario if you cannot wait until sunday definitely check saturday patreon because it's gonna be there for sure and uh, yeah i am very excited i am eager to you know check this one with you guys and uh, i hope you are as well so first episode should be around one hour I feel like usually plot episodes are longer than any other things. Make sure you have some snacks, make sure you have some drinks, I have myself some water and I feel like we're ready. So let me <laughs> and let's go. So you're Bucky and he's Buck? Bucky and Buck. Oh, I should have introduced him earlier. I know him. Everyone needs someone to write to back home. I don't know if John Egan's a pen pal type. He's hot. Not if you know where to look. Mm. I see what you mean. He's, he's a very nice actor and he's very pretty, handsome, but... You wrote me a letter? Hmm. What's it say? Bucky. Hey, hey, hey. All right, Major. All the drunks in the hundreds. Well, someone's got to make a nest for the rest of you dodos. Dodos? The birds? Bucky, since he was a kid, right? That's right, yeah. And Gail. Well, Gail's always been Gail. Oh, Gail. You're giving me the same name. It's not exactly the same name. It's not my fault. You look exactly like Buck. <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> so we have Bucky and Buck. Got it. Don't go away, Gail. Oh. Don't make me dance, March. Oh, March. Why is his voice so deep? He's uh, doing things. You don't drink, you don't gamble. You like, you like sports. Wow. <laughs> She's pretty. Marge is really beautiful. He's handsome too. <laughs> oh. oh, I love that. But you know what she, he did in real life? He was together with a girl for 10 years and then he decided to dump her and marry a girl that's 10 years younger than his girlfriend. I had to take it out. Be an observation pilot. Okay, yes. that's nice. Yes. So he reserved... Real combat? <laughs> what it's really like up there? Don't you die on me before I get over there. I think he just jinxed him. I feel like he just got jinxed. Bomb group. Oh God. Oh my God, I already got goosebumps and we just started. Yeah, now, they, now I know this is a powder that coagulates. So that's supposed to stop the bleeding. Man. The level of how fast I would try to land is beyond your understanding, guys. How fast I would be like, LAND! Are they all like that? Sadly, yes. Guys? I was really scared we we're gonna lose Bucky the first episode. Like, you know, some foreshadowing. Oh lord. Whew. It's a nice intro. I know that guy as well. Um, I watched a movie with him, The Killing of the Sacred Deer, and he was in Chernobyl as well. He has a very peculiar face, like very rememberable. Rememberable? 
you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, and by the way, he was the Elvis in the new upcoming Elvis movie. Oh, well. Yeah. Chow means to eat. This is gonna be a very difficult one. Alright, you have to do a hard landing. Bam, good, good. S steady. It stays, it stays. Still fine. It didn't derail. Good job. Professionally done. Hell of a landing. Clater, you got money on this, right? Ambone, major. Someone has a shiny tooth. Bubbles and I were, you know, keeping the traditional. So the narrator is one of these guys? Yeah. Because he said, that guy and I. A replacement. Yeah. Open it, let's see. And how exactly is this supposed to be a replacement? Is that my little pony? Sergeant, I don't know what on. But he told me that that should make up for it. You see that? Uh. Broken narwhal tusk? He pulled it down off the wall, pretended to be a unicorn. You see? <laughs> when you're drunk, you have to do all the stupid bats. Oh, I won't. I trust Tommy. Um, I don't trust anyone that's drunk with my eyes. Right, both of them. And I get a kiss. <laughs> Even he was surprised. <laughs> well, I guess you got your kiss. And another. It was my job to get Captain Brady and Crosby is talking, okay. Okay. The narrator of this show is Crosby. And Buck and Bucky seem to be the main characters. If I start to look green, it's it's happening. Oh gosh darn it, Cross. I'm sorry. It's all over me. Give me I I'm I, I apologize, but I'm not watching. Like I trust you. That's England, right? Sure. We are bad. We are we, we are somewhere that we are not supposed to be. And you know that, that that's bad, guys. That's Hold on. Shit. Yeah, good job, guys. And we are so sure that the English love the French and the French love the English. Like, one mistake like this actually can cost you your whole life. Okay, I think they're actually gonna want to make me puke. I'm 100% convinced now. I believe that the kids were fascinated for because of the aircrafts, right? Dogo! Hey, Major! Where'd you get that dog, Benny? The one of the traps! You took this baby above 10,000 feet! That dog's traumatized. Wolf's part dog. Got a name? Meatball. <laughs> Thinking you'll buzz past a bunch of guys crawling through the rain on the way to dinner. You'll come around and say thank you, Buck. I mean, I would definitely thank you for that. Especially in England with the weather. He's right, it's gonna like rain most of the times. Sure. I'm feeling like my stomach is going up and down. Tail down. Nice. The gear is not coming down. The good thing. Oh, shoot. Shoot. That sounds bad. Sure. Yeah. Is it gonna. Shot of walking away from the belly landing and we do on one wheel. Okay, so. Gee, I, I got goosebumps. Look, just thinking about it. Nowadays, they have like this. Right. Oh, Jesus. Nowadays, they have like this special 
foam. Let's just go with the word foam. They put on the runway, so when you land, you kind of like slide and you don't catch fire. For this type of uh, scenarios. That's why they're gonna probably try to land on the grass. You you know how you have to land, guys? Perfect. Just like 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 this, a little bit like this, like like this. Okay. And now you have to go out before the the fuel and everything goes poof. Run. Easy deal. That landing was perfect. I'm on it. Just think about it. If the nose was a little bit be able to, I don't know. Low. England. Everyone okay? Yes, the sir. end. No, she will. Major, it looks worse than it is. All right, sort it out. Hold it, Major. He took the fall for uh, Cr Crosby. Get a grip on that air sickness. <sighs> He's right. Hands down. He's right. I'm sorry. You you kind of cute, but he's has a point. He legit put everyone on that plane in in danger. This a unicorn story. Well, the unicorn's my favorite extinct animal. Navigator in the entire army air force. Oh, Crosby, there's gotta be somebody worse. At least one. You can get always hit by a car. It's me, those two have watched Test Pilot a few too many times. You watched Test Pilot a few too many times. I have not watched Test Pilot at all. It's the scenic route. Oh, the scenic route. Oh, very funny. I love that our main actors, Buck and Bucky, like, I've never had an easier job ever, so I love that. Boys who have yet to experience combat. Yes. Their lives depend on order and discipline and your example. Yes, sir. I just don't think I was made to sit behind a desk. Raw I'm milk. People, the people have issues. You're dismissed. So Bucky wants to actually be flying and this guy wants him to be more... So... You okay, sir? Should I call the doctor? I'm all right. What's up? Is the thematic of the first episode introduce character and NC reactors puke, vomit? Or like how many characters are gonna vomit the first episode? Eggs, French toast, flapjacks, double rations of bacon, fresh grapefruit juice, and a couple of cups of GI coffee. Wow. And then yeah. we'll come to call it the Last Supper. Guys, don't complain about the Last Supper. The, the poor guys. In, in the Pacific had to eat rice with worms. That doesn't bring us bad luck. You said Tau Sasal. Moron. I like him. You said Tau Sasal. <laughs> You're stupid, I like him. <laughs> oh Lord, hey, Chuck. I'm flying with you today. Alright, I'll pass on the exit. What about some OJ? I want formation so damn tight you wouldn't be able to slip a dime through our wingtips. Yes sir, Major. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Right, there you go, you have it. As you were. <laughs> it even inspired me to stay a little bit straighter. After formation, the 100th will join the 94th, 95th, and the 96th bomber groups. We will be in the low, low. This is the guy who puked on his desk, right? Major? Thanks, sir. Okay. Lights, please. That's a nice brief, though. Very short, point, 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 not a lot of talk. I like that. Nope. Both naval and ground base flak positions along the Frisian Islands immediately after the turn follow the river. Here you go, Major. Thank you. Come on, Kurt. Okay, this is our fr first mission, Bremen. So close, I want you on my way today. <laughs> that you can smell my aftershave. Nice. Captain Phillips, too. Okay. If anyone needs us. Well, I think uh, no one wants you. In the way not, not to, you know, like, usually you ask for a priest when you're about to die. Two corners bitten off, one for each mission, here I am. Take. That's a nice friend. He's giving him his lucky money. Right. On his first mission. Can you imagine the nerves, the, not the emotions, then I think nerves is the word. She calls you the sweet of the Ritz. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, so Major is the person that's flying the aircraft, the plane. Fuel transfer valves and switches. Both transfer valves are off and switches off. I actually had to do this as well with my flight attendant training. Fuel shut off switches. All four open. Not the Cal buttons. Box. Open left and lock. Throttles. But the checklist. It's good to have you with us, Colonel. This is the guy that vomited. The, those are, I think those are the aerodynamics. Like, um, the, the, they pump, I, I think, okay, don't, don't quote me. I'm not sure. I think they pump a type of liquid that helps the engine to start, but I'm not exactly sure. Because if we got separated, the German fighters could pick us off one by one. That's dangerous, boys. That's dangerous. In my opinion, I personally think that I will be more attached to this series than the other two. Here we go, fellas. Green for takeoff. Oh my god, I'm nervous for our first mission. Marge. Aww. Motivation to go back. I noticed that he was watching the clock, so I believe they have like a certain time interval that each plane can uh, depart after the other one. I'm excited! I'm getting emotional because I'm excited. <sighs> yeah, no. No, 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 no. Never! You know when you will see me in, in a, a thing like that? Never! At 10,000 feet, some symptoms of, um, what the hell is it called? Hypoxia can install. So you have to make sure that the oxygen is good. Nah, is they gonna use flare as a formation? <gasps> That's smart. Lost the crew. I think I saw a flare right below us. Copy. You see who it came from? Negative. I can't see a thing out there. Oh no 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 no! Go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up, go up. Pull, 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 pull. Shit, 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 shit! No, 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 no! The crew, we got another hour climbing through this muck. Keep your eyes peeled. Okay, this this is gonna be very fascinating for me. Christ, we need to catch up to the rest of the group. Oh God, this is gonna be difficult. Formation's a mess. You're putting your squadron in jeopardy. Pacer lead, Roger. That motor is gonna give up. Oh my! Oh, I I, I like it. <laughs> I I feel it. Oh, I'm gonna I'm gonna give you my opinion at the end at the end of the episodes episode. Can they climb? I don't know if these, these planes have like a limit climb. But it's a propeller, so I don't think. Do you need... I mean, it's the weather. Oh, this guy... Where are the jewels? They're gonna have to return. I mean, I can understand that you don't want to drop bombs on something you do not really see, but if there is... Huh? There is people shooting at you from down below. Flag stopped. I guess that's a reason, no? You know what that means, boys. Okay. Get ready, fellas. Aircrafts are coming. Goosebump check! Can they like eject from these planes? Oh come on man! First mission, you can't jam first mission! Oh burns, it was hot as hell. Shoo, sure, that's bad, bad, bad. It's like John Bas Bastillon. Bast the carburetor mixture link causes spark plugs to load up and foul. It should just take a few hours to fix. They're back. But they, they definitely had, had some losses. 
He's looking at the formation right now and it's like a few planes are kind of missing. This guy's freezing, the other one burned his hands. I can't see what's puking, but let me know if it was blood. Veal squat was uh, doing bad job. Jesus, it looks like Swiss cheese. I mean, they could have exploded the fuel tank at any time. Like, how, how did this not go in flames is beyond the level of my understanding. Didn't drop a single bomb. I know. Let's go. I don't like the word interrogation. I would prefer something like debrief. You tell me. I don't know what to say. It's chaos. It's bad. You've seen it now. The chances of you dying are high. So. Our enemy is fast. A few things you could have. Yeah. Oh my god. Let's see. Uh, now you ought to report to the hospital after the interrogation. Got it? Yes, Let's just go with debrief. Some coffee, Major? John, some coffee. Give me that. You're welcome. He just made himself some Irish coffee. I think this is the episode that we're gonna see him actually go against the wish. I just pulled on a transport to London. I see a specialist. Jesus. Okay. All right. Heal fast, Dicky. I need my co-pilot back. Dicky. Take care. <laughs> You want to come? Oh, thank you, Kurt. I'm, I'm gonna. I'm Kurt. Gonna... Okay, his name is Kurt. Patrick. He's drinking with the dead. We do this in Romania as well. Because me, I don't, I don't feel a thing. I think you feel frustration because you were not up in the air with them, in my opinion. But you know, I'm not doctor. Horsing around, I'm not horse. Huh? Huh? You're from New York, right? Ooh! <laughs> He delivered. He delivered. He definitely hit you. I think your ancestor felt that too. No! All right, Meatball. <laughs> Meatball as his dog. <laughs> And Colonel Hogland didn't think much of your skills as an air well, I didn't think too much. Too much of his flying. Sorry, Jack. The boys are back with me again. As long as I get my flight back. Demoted. He wanted to be demoted. You son of a bitch. Was it mine? <laughs> I wouldn't recommend it. You're both sons of bitches. You got up early this morning? Maybe he didn't even sleep. Oh, I can read upside down, Buck. All I said was your army's right about you being a leader. <laughs> but you lead best as a squadron commander. You don't got so many flowers. So he went, Buck went and spoke for Buck. Him. I'll help you. I'd appreciate that. I like their friendship. And to be you, Buck. Don't count on it. Corporal Ken Lemons was one of our best crew chiefs. He was 19 years old. Okay, that's an interesting uh, design painted there. Fire. Could use some help. Yes, please. Shoot! That's bad. I, I I know bad when I see it. And that, that that's bad. Uh, practice mission, he went into his turn too early, too slow. Same goes for you. Yes, sir. That's it. All right. There we go. I'm gonna bang that boys. They are all so young. Like that guy that's writing looks like 14. We all go down. Come on, light enough. Is it just me or everybody feels like they look super young? Coming up, mate. No, I admire you, Americans. Mate. Up there in broad daylight. Since it's German, the bombing during the day is suicide. I could foresee in future American strategy adjusting due to the unfortunate losses you'll no doubt continue to suffer. How does one pick if they want to be bombing during the day or bombing during the night? I heard you sing, Major. Oh, he does, and he loves unicorns. 
25 feet over the wrong way. Yeah. Sound is the grave. Beautiful. Mm. Poetic. Y your buck. And he's bucking. Yeah. It's easy. Was there a shortage of nicknames in the hundred? <laughs> <laughs> Just a shortage of crews. Mm. Mm. So, f so funny, this guy. Love it. I can see f glasses flying soon. Hey, hey, please. Uh, I want this guy. Please. Fight! 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 Uh, okay. fight. <laughs> To you. I'm just saying. The, the clap, I believe it's a disease. Now, what type of disease it is, I don't know. If you guys know what the clap is, let me know in the comments. Time to show them what we're made of. Absolutely. The Brits versus the Americans. Let's go. Do you fight in a night, Brian? Let's go, New York. <laughs> Is he all right? Sir, let me help you. Get up. Come on. Did he faint? Is he alive? Oh, he's alive. Never mess with the Irish. That was a good one. I love that one. Practice nighttime area bombing. Return to Hitler. Form you war. Okay. So Americans attack during the day. Americans could even attempt something as difficult and dangerous as precision bombing. They were on every flight with us. I would not relax until we came home. It's a team effort. So everybody, the Americans attack during the day and the Brits attack during the night. Information you have to take from there. I bet you the carton in the low low again. You think? At ease, gentlemen. Someone's late. Come on, sir. I like their jackets with the fluff. And the target for today is... Submarine pans in Trondheim, Norway. All right, I guess. Whatever that means. Let's go. Bubbles. Six as a dog. Oh, shoot. I fly. <laughs> The hell? You are shaking. <sighs> like a leaf. You following me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't be nervous. Oh, uh, this is the guy that vomited. Pump son. Hershey's good. Show quantity. Good. We're ready to start. I feel bad for him. I don't know his name. I forgot his name. We're not gonna be the reason this goes off late. Hey, sir. Starting one. Morning! Morning! Douglas! Harry Crosby! Harry, alright, Harry. His snow globe has flamingos and a palm tree. Yeah. It's my first time in the lead. Yeah, well, I've seen bubbles do it a million times. Oh. Uh, be that hard. No pressure, no pressure. Poor guy. You clean this thing? Yeah. Yes! Yeah? Yeah. Light it up on fire, light it up on fire. That's how you clean a hard stand. There's one hot bastard. Oh, he's so wholesome. Oh, oh, that's a nice transition there. That was a nice transition. I love that. That looked very, very well done. He doesn't look very good, guys. He looks a bit uh, green. No, no, no. Command pilot the top turret. Set out a flare. See if they'll get in formation. Roger, we'll go. So his formation and Buck's formation is good, but the other formation is bad. The navigator new heading. Oh shoot. Crosby. Crosby is a bit busy uh, puking his guts out and making me sick. Just put your mask on and read the damn maps, come on! Man, you can't, you can't be navigator if you can't navigate. My timing says we should be there any second now. I'm sorry, but uh, it's the truth. Red turn now to zero seven five degrees. 
Inbound to the target. Another right turn to one four zero. I'm sorry, but no, no. Watch the crew. Flat two three at flat level. Shoot. I want to see how this bombing works. Cuz they they haven't dropped a bomb since uh since now I guess. Cuz the first you remember the first uh, episode it was a uh, failed mission. Jesus. I think that's puked in in there. It's oh. So this is like we saw in an, in the other two series, like air support, when you just give them the coordinates to the radio, and then you just. Here, the pilot, it's your plane. Roger that. I think. Navigator to pilot. All right, let's warm up with the other cools. Let's see if that helps. So, get more. It's dying. Keep up the space. Roger. So what are they gonna do? Like we got a straggler, we're gonna throttle down and stick with him. Await instructions. Okay, so they are all gonna go slower. They just so so they can <laughs> it helps have friends in high places. Hunting. They keep information. Just give me a minute. Alright. I'm sorry, Crosby, but uh I need that plan. On it. It's coming up, sir. Give me one second. There is a little bit of vomit on his map. If Fiddick has to put her down, at least he's on land. Sounds like a good plan to me. Full with vomit, but. 244, Roger, 244. Let's go to 244. Hey, level. Well, I guess you don't go anywhere. Man, they were fast. Jeez. What type of aircrafts did the Germans use? They were like pff, Roger, keep an eye super out fast. Roger that. We're setting ducks at half speed. And Kerner's men will be dead if we don't. We're not leaving them behind. I mean, yes, sir. I guess they have more chances of survival if they're in a group, right? Uh. We don't know yet. Give me one second. Let me chill and see. Nice work, Cross. Poor Cross. And what if we are not? Oh, if we are. Whew. I mean, it's not like I, 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 I don't trust Cross, but uh, he's puking. He has vomit on his head. He feels sick. Losing number three. All right, let's pick up some speed on his. Head. Right gear down. Oh my lord, have mercy. Speed is 115. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's too low, load. Load. It's too low. You have to pull. pull, pull. Break. Don't take the house. No, poor garden. Emergency landing. Uh, touchdown. I mean, I wasn't that bad, right? It was horrible. <laughs> <laughs> Just that vomit on his head. It's fine, you did good, Crosby. They start rolling down my forehead. I think, holy mackerel, Crosby. Holy mackerel, you've been hit. You know, I washed my hair twice. I still can't get the smell out. <laughs> they call him Bing back home. Bing Crosby? That's just lazy. Yeah, it's too. Can you see him? I can't. <laughs> like a donkey. No, no, not a note, sir. Don't call him vomit or puke or something. With enough enthusiasm, it really don't matter. I'll see you at the club, Cross. I'm buying. My bubbles. Sir. I like bubbles. From the Power Puff Girls. He thinks my nickname's lazy? I wouldn't even try to be a pilot. Be a radio man. <laughs> you hold on to it for now. It's working well for you. Yeah, but it's working well for you, too. Uh, nope. Seems to have forgotten. 
P.S. Say hi to Bubbles for me. Oh, <laughs> that's sweet. That's sweet. I like that. How she signs him. Mrs. Jean Crosby, you still can't get over that. <laughs> one, a two, a one, two, three, four. They have it so much different than Band of Brother and the Pacific. Like they have music and food. Nothing. Vocals. No chance. <laughs> He almost sings as bad as I do. Yeah. Two boxes I can get her to laugh inside a minute. You get a shot down, it's gonna be a sight to see. Hurts. Hurts! <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's Buck and John. That's a very, very good question. But we're safe to some here. Par private party. They're looking after us. It turns out that they don't like the English much either. But they like me because I'm Irish. Irish, I told you, I'm an American boy. Anyway. Hold on. Oh, my Lord. Hold on. Kurt. I wanted to call you. Yes, I can't laugh on you. Can you tell me something funny? Yeah, tell us the joke. It's the difference between a hippo and a zippo. Zippo is uh, lighter, no? One's really heavy, the other's a little lighter. <laughs> Brought the group back home. And you got Betty to Scotland. Alive. He did a good job, but... Um... Let's go! Yeah, I don't know. Hey, you gonna bet me money on this race? Rank has its privileges, boys. <laughs> I see money changing hands. I hope that's going on me. Oh, I got five. Here's the deal. I like Buck and Bucky. Two left for the illicit oh, yeah, men. We can hear the starter pistol go. Are you ready? Ready. With my athleticism, I would have already hugged one of those pillars. Push, boys. <laughs> What's up, fellas? Okay. Let's head for the shelters. Hurry it up. Okay, they're getting bombarded themselves. Yeah. What could be next? Can't tell you the amount of nights I spent sleeping on benches in Casper's parlors and pony tracks. Drinking is already an addiction, but gambling. But he kept doing it. No, it's an addiction. It's an issue. Well, then why didn't you agree with him? Didn't like his delivery. Huh. Well, if you aren't a betting man, what's the need? Not so fast, right? Do, am I the only one that feels that these episodes are going super extra fast? They are just they're very enjoyable and i i really actually like them a lot i i hope you guys enjoy them as well as as much as i do at least so this was the first two episodes excited for next week a reminder they release friday night for me so saturday like today i'm reacting and sunday hopefully we'll be posting them i hope you guys enjoy them consider subscribing if you do and uh, have a great one everybody see you on twitch see you on patreon see you everywhere much love to you Bye-bye.